everyone, welcome back. This is your girl Toya T and today I'm doing another uh, DYE how-to. So uh, in my mother's house, as I said before, I'm working on a home improvement project, organizing, redesigning, uh, so she can have a better looking and home. So uh, she has a water heater that is on uh, the first floor, ground floor of her house and she wanted to cover it so no one can see it. There's no closet there, she just got it. So she bought this wall divider to cover it, but you can still see the water heater through the little windows. So I decided that maybe I should put some pictures here. At first I was gonna put some fabric back here so you wouldn't be able to see it, but I said, you know what, maybe we should put pictures because uh, I think it would be a great idea. You'd be able to kind of use it multi-purposely. So maybe use it as a different kind of frame. Uh, so at first I told her, I asked her if she wanted to have real pictures or kind of like um, images and stuff. Uh, so she said she wanted images since no one really will be down here to look at it. So I decided to cut out some pictures that I have. So I already started, and as you can see, I already started putting up these pictures that I have. Um, I had a postcard um, book full of little postcard images from the Schomburg Center and uh, I hadn't used them. I think I had it for at least since last summer. So I was like, oh, this is a great way to use it uh, without it going to waste. So I picked a lot of the pictures, as you can see, um, that are kind of, uh, you know, vertically, um, that, that are positioned vertically, and I pasted them or glued them onto an uh, extra piece of cardboard. So you can see right here, so it can have some backing on the back of this so it'd be easier to, to stick on. So what I'm doing is just so easy and so cheap. So if you have any pictures or images, maybe you have photographs that you wanna put here instead, um, you just put it on a piece of cardboard and I'm cutting it so that it fits into the images easily, into the little picture frames back here. And one second. And so you just have, I have some Gorilla Tape, which is really good sticky tape. And all I'm doing is taking a little bit of the tape, so not doing anything that's gonna ruin um, the room divider and not, nothing that you can't change out. So eventually um, she doesn't like these pictures. You can always uh, move it out for other pictures um, or put cloth there eventually. Um, which is also a very simple way to do it. Or you can have, even put mirrors. I think that'd be a really cool idea to put mirrors back there. So I just have it like this. And I think I'm gonna cut it a little bit more because it has this border. So cut it at the white border so it fits more into these really small uh, frames right here, little windows. So I've cut it, as you can see. And now I'm just gonna stick it back here. So, I'm lining it up and then sticking it on the back. So it's a little high, so I'll just move this down. And very easy, so I haven't stapled it, I haven't glued it on the back of here. It doesn't fit into where I want it, so I move it down a little bit. That's perfect. So it's something that I, I like the position of it so I can tape the back of it. So I'm gonna do the whole thing and I'm gonna show you what it looks like at the end. And um, now I'm all done. So now you can see I've completed it. I put the tape on the back of it. And now we have something that covers up the water heater behind it, but has a little bit of uh, pictures so that it adds a little color to the room and a nice little design element uh, without it looking tacky or it being overly expensive. So um, that's an easy way, as I was saying before, to uh, do something that, you know, repurposes or, or redesign something that you had in your house. So if you have any questions about how to do this, you have any comments, please subscribe, share, and, and comment about it. Tell your friends, like it, dislike this video, um, it, and let me know what you think about projects like these if you want me to do more things like this. And I will see you guys later. Bye.